Help. Engaged. Greetings everyone, and welcome to the Snake vs. Quiet boss fight. This video will show the best strategies to use when you first encounter her. But as you may have noticed, in the top left and right corners, there are links to two other strategies for this particular boss level enemy, but more about that in a moment. Boss, you okay? Could it be that sniper? Quiet. Quiet. Our silent assassin. Where's the sniping point? Right here. And that's the first thing you should do, tag her with your binoculars. Next, try to maneuver your way behind her. You can try to target her with your sniper gun, from the starting point, if you have one, but chances are, you will probably miss a lot, because she is currently quite far away, so it's best to get a little closer to her, before attacking. But anyway, about those links. Okay, so each main story episode, of this game, has certain additional tasks you can complete, which will earn you extra bonus points towards your overall score. Here are the additional tasks for this mission. By doing what I do, in this video, you will be able to complete the first three tasks. But to complete the final task, you can try either of the two strategies, found in the top corners of your screen. If, for whatever reason, the links do not work, then check in the video description below, where the links will be added, as soon as the respective videos are uploaded. Anyway, back to the task at hand. I would recommend a stun grenade, to get her off her perch. You can also try climbing up there, but she has always jumped away, whenever I've tried, so I personally, wouldn't bother with that. The enemy sniper just disappeared. Okay, this white circular arc, represents the suspicion indicator, and where it is positioned, relates to where the threat is coming from, which in this case is from the left of the screen. If you see it during this fight, get behind some cover immediately, or you will either be killed outright, or get seriously injured. Zero visibility. If you can't mark them, you don't stand a chance. Stay sharp. So, there are various ways to keep track of where she is. I will list them as they are encountered. The first is the suspicion indicator, which we have just discussed. Another is to use your binoculars microphone, to keep track of her footsteps while she moves. You can also hear her humming, while she has taken a sniping position. Tracking her humming, is probably the best way to locate her. And yet another method, is to see the flash from her rifle lens, which we are just about to see, right now. There, you only see it for a split second, which is why I paused the video. Okay. So allow me to show you a useful strategy to use against her. I call it, peek a boom Once you know where she is, while still in cover, get your binoculars ready. Zoom in once or twice, and then take a quick peek. Hopefully, you will be able to tag her. Once tagged, you should line her up in your sights from cover, preferably the head, and then quickly take a peek, and fire. Hence the name, Pika Boom. Bad pun, definitely intended. Okay, she's on the move. Try to use the previously discussed tactics to keep track of her. Also, another visual clue. She leaves a trail of dust as she runs, which is especially important now, because as you just saw, she also has the ability to disappear. Try not to wander too far, from cover, while you track her. Before we can get to the peekaboo part, we need to do a little peekaboo first to tag her. Peekaboo, bitch. Ha, 2 minutes and 32 seconds to take her down. Not bad. Did you get her? Those abilities of hers. No doubt about it, she has to be one of the skulls. Now move in and finish your boss. She's working for Cypher. The female sniper. Quiet. Don't worry, I will upload all the movies and cutscenes in another video. She's one of the 
the skulls. Hurry up and kill what her. What has been updated? No. Killing her would be a waste. Bring her back here. Boss. Boss. If I wanted to kill her, I wouldn't have been using non-lethal weapons. Besides, it doesn't matter what weapons you were using, you can only kill her here, or at least it appears that way, because I haven't tried to kill her. Who would be stupid enough to kill such a potentially valuable ally? Not forgetting of course, that she's a total babe. Support helicopter Boss, requested. you're not thinking of bringing her back here are you? She works for Cypher. We don't even know the extent of her abilities. She is not setting foot on this base. Good word, boss. Can't believe you took her down alive. Now bring her back here. Let's find out what she really is. This is too dangerous. Kill her. Don't bring her to our home. This is the boss's decision. I'll send the extraction chopper. Boss, you know I've always got your back. If you bring her here, I'll just have her killed. This is Pequot. Arriving shortly at LZ. This is Pequot. On station at LZ. Boss, no. Mission info has been updated. Gaining altitude. I took her out so quickly, that I didn't have a chance to explain some other tactics and strategies. No matter, I still have two other videos to explain the remaining tactics in, so keep an eye out for them in the near future. So why are we still here? To look at the final score of course. This is an S rank walkthrough, so it's time to show the proof. And there you go, an S rank, with a final score of over 180,000 points. And this could have been even higher, if I had succeeded in the fourth optional task, but that will be addressed in the next two videos. Anyway, that's all we've got time for, so please remember to comment, thumbs up and subscribe, if you liked this video or found it helpful. This is Blade, and it's goodbye from me.